is Marisa Yase. My name is Katie. Hi, I'm Dan. Hi, uh, my name is Anjali John. Uh, I do energy research um, using rotating discs and rotating ring disc electrodes. The auto lab rotating disc electrode is excellent due to having the mercury contact at the top. It's dead silent, it can rotate at a uh, load of uh, rotation speeds, which is particularly useful for uh, generating that kind of data without uh, noise from mechanical motion. My project is mainly focusing on hydrogen peroxide production. So one main reason that I really like the white olive one is that they have very high compliance. So then we can also uh, apply very high potential to the counter electrode. Another main thing about the white olive is that you can track the potential that apply to the counter electrode, which is amazing. We go out into the lab so we can actually extract the kind of raw data that we're going to a normal white olive or camogram and then process that ourselves. So kind of taking that unknown element out of the equation and getting more of the information ourselves. One of the reasons that we really like the 128 n is because of the ability to sample really fast, but also the amount of data points that it can store. So we can actually capture a full square wave with good fast sampling and truly replicate what's happening. So I've been using the PDSAT to afford for the past year or so. It's quite inexpensive for like what it is capable of doing. I can measure the OCP and the CD in the same procedure. Uh, unlike other potential stats that I would have to measure the OCP in a different procedure and then remember the number and come and put it uh, in while taking the CD. The software itself can use multiple, you can program in multiple rotation rates uh, extremely easily. So you can just set up an experiment, leave it to run and then come back after running multiple rotation rates, multiple scan rates, you can change all your parameters extremely easy on a nice user interface.